heart failure may progress through four stages, often called stage A through stage D. At stage D, or end stage heart failure, your symptoms are more severe, and the usual treatments no longer help much to improve them. Stage D heart failure can also mean hospitalizations to get symptoms under control. Keep in mind that using MODS, you can do a lot to manage your heart failure symptoms and slow down the progression of the disease. But if your heart failure reaches stage D, it's time to look at other options. A left ventricular assist device, or LVAD, is a mechanical device placed into your body to help pump blood from your heart. An LVAD doesn't replace your heart, but it supports your heart's main pumping chamber. An LVAD is often used as a temporary option to help people who are waiting for a heart transplant. In other cases, it can be implanted long term. An LVAD can extend your life and give you a better quality of life. Another option that might be considered with stage D heart failure is a heart transplant. A heart transplant is a surgery that removes a diseased heart and replaces it with a heart from a human organ donor. In stage D heart failure, you might be a candidate for a heart transplant if there's a low chance of living for more than a year if a transplant doesn't happen. If you don't have any other serious medical conditions that would reduce your life expectancy, and if your doctor expects that a transplant will help in your case, allowing you to live longer and with a better quality of life. Not everyone with late stage heart failure wants to have an LVAD or heart transplant, or is a candidate for these treatments. Other options include palliative care and hospice. Palliative care is specialized medical care that provides extra support to give patients and their families a better quality of life. It can be used alone or with other heart failure treatments, and you can receive it at any stage of life, even for many years at a stretch. Palliative care providers help patients manage shortness of breath, fluid retention, and other symptoms such as nausea or pain. An appointment with a palliative care provider also gives you and your family a chance to talk about your goals and make sure the care you receive matches your needs and values. Hospice is available to people who have a serious illness and are not expected to live longer than six months. The focus of hospice is comfort near the end of life. Hospice helps people live life as fully as possible, maintain their dignity, and keep personal control over their life. If you haven't already filled out an advanced directive form or power of attorney, in stage D heart failure, it's important to do so. These forms ensure that your wishes are known and there's someone to speak for you. If you have any questions about options for end stage heart failure, please ask. We want to support you in every way possible.